All right, guys, Mikey here from Mikey's Iron Rage. And guys, I got an awesome direct video comparison for use today. And we're going to do it on 2006, Mr. Olympia Jay Cutler versus 2009, Mr. Olympia Jay Cutler. And I thought that these two would match up very, very well against each other. So I figured we'd put them up a, in a direct video comparison. And I tell you right off the bat, I think 2006 looks awesome, and his skin color in 2006 is so much better than 2009, but the lighting in 2009 is a lot better than 2006. I wish the lighting in 2006 was more like 2009. Jay looked really good in 2009, especially with the lighting, and the lighting was a lot better in 2009 at the night show than it was in prejudging. Wow, Jay Cutler's back in 2006 looks really fucking good. Really good. I think it looks a little bit better than 2009 and if you look at the rear lat spread his uh, traps are popping in 2006 and guys if you're new to my channel usually the first uh, part of the direct video comparison I have them uh, posing individually and then the second part of the video is them posing side by side but my editing software was fucking up on me this morning so we couldn't do it uh, individually so we're gonna have to skip to the best part which is them posing side by side pose for pose shot for shot and I tell you I'm really liking this 2006 version of Jay Cutler look at the side chest Look at the striations in that side chest. I tell you, Jay looks really good in 2006. And it's that skin color. The skin color is just absolutely perfect. Absolutely perfect. Now, 2007 Jay Cutler? I don't know what the fuck happened to Jay Cutler in 2007. He totally came in off. And Victor Martinez? Victor Martinez should have won the whole Mr. Olympia in 2007. But I digress because bodybuilding politics just really suck. Wow, Jay's arms are fucking huge too, huh? In 2006? Look at Jay hitting the Superman pose in 2006. So let's just really look at the back shots, guys. I'm telling you, Jay Cutler in the rear double bicep is a little bit better in 2006. And I tell you something else. In 2005, his rear double bicep might have been the best I've ever seen it in 2005. And then Jay Cutler just got a little bit better in 2006. Then, like I said, 2007, he should have never won it. 2008, he lost it to Dexter. 2009, he came back and won it again. He's the only person that ever did that who won the Olympia, lost the Olympia, then won the Olympia again. Jay Cutler, 2009, was just unbelievable. And then I would say fucking Dexter Jackson should have placed second in 2009, not fucking the gremlin Branch Warren. I mean, that really pissed me off when Branch Warren won the 2000, well, came in second at the 2009 Mr. Olympia, but I digress. So guys, let me know what you think in the comment section below, and who do you think was better? Well, what year, Jay Cutler, do you think was better? 2006 or 2009? Because I'm going to go with 2009. But 2006 was a really good underrated year for Jay Cutler. So guys, if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed yet, tickle that Kevin Leveroni icon button. Mikey's Iron Rage. Peace out, guys.